What's good y'all? Welcome back or to the channel. Today we are going to be surprising my girlfriend with a new snowmobile. Well, not really for her. It's for me. She hasn't seen it yet. So pretty much how this went down was I told her I was going to look at sleds this weekend, right? So I was like, you know, I'm just going to go look, window shop, kind of feel them out, see which one I want. And yeah, you know how that goes. I ended up actually buying a sled and she found out I bought a sled because I sent her a picture and I said, look what's coming home with me. And now she's on her way over and I'm going to be showing her my new sled. For those of you that may have not seen yet, I have got myself a 2022 Summit 850-154. I mean, guys, just look at it. It looks amazing. And obviously, we are going to be throwing a wrap on it. We're going to be throwing some CNAs on it. A whole bunch of other aftermarket goodies. But for now, just enjoyed it in its stock form while it lasts. As all of you know and my girlfriend knows, I am a avid Polaris rider. But I have made the decision to switch to Skidoo because my snow check is taking forever once again to come in. So we're going to be getting my girlfriend's reaction of my Skidoo. She is probably didn't expect me to get one. She probably thought I was getting our Polaris. So we're going to see what she thinks of the Summit. She just texted me that she is here. Let's get her reaction. And what do you think? Wow. You like it? I do. A little something different? I like the black. I know, right? Like, it actually looks good. Like, obviously, I'm going to wrap it. But, like, overall, it looks amazing. Sit on it. See what you think compared to my old one. The seat's pretty comfy. It's a little hard, but... It's, it's like, narrower. It's weird. Like, it has a pitch to it, and it's yeah. narrow up by your legs. But I actually, I like it a lot. I like it. So, what do you think? You think I should have kept the other one, or you like this one? I kind of like the black. Like, I don't know. Wait, you haven't seen the wrap. They haven't seen the wrap, but they're not going to see it yet till it actually gets ordered. I'm going to show you what I think I'm going to do. Yeah. Huh? That's, that's clean. That's hard, isn't it? That's hard. I like it. I like so just picture like the, the wrap you saw. Uh -huh. um, color coordinated bar, riser, color coordinated skis, and bumper. Yeah. Yeah. It'd be cute, cool to do those like pops of color here. Like Brandon know? did, the, the protectors. Yeah. Yeah, just match the colors of that, but... I know the black, the black does look good. Like, I'm not a black sled person whatsoever, but this one spoke to me. Well, what I like, you can, like, customize it. Like, you can add different colors well, to it. Well, I was telling them. Yeah, check that out. Look at the storage department. Mm. Owner's manual. It's a 2022. Nice. So, I was telling them earlier, what I didn't tell you is there's, like, there was two of these. Or they had actually, like, 30 of them. Mm -hmm. But there's two that I wanted. It was either all black I can get or the same exact sled where this was, like, orange and gray. So, like... Mm -hmm. orange skid orange spindles and then orange and gray color combo and my dad really liked that one but i was like i need to get all black so that when i wrap it i have a clean slate because if i get orange and gray i'm stuck with doing either orange or gray i agree so i went with this one and we were back and forth so when we were there i was between getting a 154 this track length mm -hmm. like my other sled or a 146 like brandon shorter and we were back and forth like i was at least for two hours just sitting on them looking at them like like overthinking and beyond thinking like Mm -hmm. Should I get a 154 or 146? And there was something about this particular sled. I don't know what it was, but every single time I'd go look at another one, I'd this one would catch my eye, and I'd walk back over to it and look at it every single time. Yeah. I, and like I don't know, it spoke to me. There was something about this particular one that was like, this is meant to be. This is mine. I feel like it's just very clean. Like it's in very very good. Condition. It's simple. I mean, it's a 22. It's got some, a couple miles on it, but overall. Just gotta get a shorter flap. What do you think? Can I, rock it? I think you could. Wait, let me see if I could do this. This is pretty cool. It might be dead. Oh, okay. <laughs> Wait, it started? Push button start. That's so nice. Oh, easy now. And the hand warmers, you gotta feel these. They get so hot. That's nice. Push yeah. Start. They're warming up already. I know, they're so much better than the players ones. Oh, Here. Nice. Just press and hold that. Just hold it. Isn't that nice? I need that. It's so nice. And I feel like you don't even need like that crazy of a display. Like you're riding. That's what I so. said. I literally said like, usually That's I like perfect. the latest and greatest, like the most expensive stuff. But I had that expensive display on my other one. When did you use it? I didn't touch it, never. Yeah. I literally looked at it to see what the temp was, and I was like, okay, 
we're good to ride. That was it. I never like used it, so I'm like, this is perfectly fine for me. Because you had the like um, maps. I had the GPS, never touched it. So it's like, what's the point? Like, I want to truly build this sled and make it like I don't know. I really like it for some reason. It just something about it I really like. I it's think very it's very sleek and clean. Mm-hmm. I think that's what I like most. And I like that it's something new, something I've never had before. Yeah. It's just I don't know. It's exciting and I love it. It'd be good to take it out for your first time. I know. I can't wait. <laughs> well, we got to get a can on there. We got to get a wrap. We got to get, gotta get some things going. But I, I'm just really happy with it. I don't know. What do you think? I like it a lot. I'm a skidoo boy now. <laughs> safe to say that my girlfriend absolutely loves the 2022 Skidoo Summit 850-154. Even talked about taking it as her own sled for herself, which I don't know. We'll see how that goes. And the main reason is this button right here. She loves the shot because she is able to start her own sled because otherwise it would be me pulling that rope for her every single time she wanted her sled started. So maybe if she's lucky, she will get to ride this one and I will take my 9R. Anyways, I'm glad she's happy with the purchase and likes the new sled. With all that being said, I'm gonna wrap this one up right here. If you guys like today's video, smash a huge thumbs up on today's video. Comment section below, let me know what you think of the Skidoo Summit. This is our second video of this sled on the channel. If you have not seen the first, I'm gonna link it in the description. Go check it out. Like I always say, if you guys are new here or you've been watching for a while and you're not already subscribed, go ahead and hit that subscribe button and I will catch you guys in the next video. Peace out. Like, ride with me if you ride with me, you can slide with me if you feel like 550 on the fast sticky, come get high with me, that's a deal, right?